Okay, so following on from section three, uh, we got a sidings area here that we want to finish off. Uh, so in section two, I showed you how to scrunch up and how to do like a rough area. So we're going to do that on here, uh, but we have to build it up. So start the grass spacing glue first, pour some on. I'm brushing it in again. You can see now I'm brushing over some of the areas that I've done. Uh, don't worry again, you can go over the top of it. You can leave it there. It's fine. Okay, so glue is down. Do that a little bit for that. Glue is down. Uh, use back, we're using the micro, the PSG1. Two mil spring grass. Load the hopper up. Again, as long as the clip is in the vicinity, it's fine. And just grass the area. So using the start the grass layering spray, start layering up now using your four mil grasses. You've noticed that I've uh, screened or masked off the, the track. It's just that I just don't want to get any on there. Um, it just peel it off. Once it's dry, peel it off. Um, you can even touch up then if you want to uh, using the precision applicator, which I'll show you later on. Uh, but we're now going to start layering this up now to start making it look um, like a sidings area. So, four mil autumn grass. We've sprayed the spray down, clip it on, and apply. Same process again, spray on, introduce your brown grasses, so your patches and your deads, this is a patchy four. Now a bit of dead for. And we'll finish off with a bit of six mil, six mil wild meadow. Spray over the top. So now, now we want to start scrunching up, but for this I'm going to use uh, an end of a brush just to give a little bit more detail than one of my fingers. Just squash it up. Again, be as rough as you like. It doesn't matter, you're going to be covered in the baseboard as we, uh, uh, if you can see it. You can see that I've gone back down to a baseboard color. Uh, so again, using the two mil, use the, uh, to cover the baseboard up. Spray it over. And then using a the brown four mil, start picking up them little tough areas. 
A good layer of layering spray. Move the applicator around so it gets onto all the different types of peaks. And there we go. There you can see a side ends now with rough grass with peak with natural tufts showing. Uh, it looks like it's been overgrown. Um, and it's blended lovely into the into the mountain using all the different techniques that he's doing. Thank you very much. Bye.